Hi, I'm James Goldsworthy, auctioneer for Ray White here on the Sunshine Coast. With your auction fast approaching, the purpose of this video is to address some of the questions and queries you may have leading in to the sale day. We'll address the role of your auctioneer, discuss what will be happening behind the scenes uh, this week and all the activity your agent will be undertaking, and then obviously discuss the auction day itself. Well firstly, your auctioneer is on your side. The role of your auctioneer is to secure you the best possible price the market will support. Your auctioneer will be energetic, enthusiastic and encouraging the buyers on auction day. Your auctioneer will support your position and keep the bidding increments as big as possible for as long as possible. You may actually hear your auctioneer not accept a bid with the eye of getting a bigger or better bid from another party. Make no mistake, the role of your auctioneer is to get you the very best price. Behind the scenes, this week, your agent will be working feverishly to confirm with as many bidders as possible for your auction day. You'll receive a report and a recommendation in regards to the reserve price and pricing strategy moving forward in the coming days. Please take the time to review this report and an overview of your campaign. The recommendation around reserve price is a recommendation that the agent believes the property can and will be sold for at auction. On the day of the auction, your agent will be in contact with all key parties, wishing them luck and obviously calming any of those last minute nerves. At this late stage of the sale, you should have a lot of confidence that your agent has done everything in their power to generate the best possible outcome for you come auction day. Prior to your auction, another open home will be conducted. We'd ask that you come back to the property five minutes prior to your advertised auction time. If you're away, we'll simply give you a phone call five minutes prior to us commencing. In this chat, five minutes before the auction, we'll give you an overview of who's there, who's registered to bid, and fundamentally what to expect. It will take your auctioneer a couple of moments to describe and run through the formalities of the auction. That is, the auction terms and conditions, and drawing attention to the contract of sale. Your auctioneer will then give a brief description of the property prior to the commencement of bidding. Having conducted thousands of property auctions, there are only three outcomes or scenarios that we'll be faced with at auction. The first scenario, and obviously the most favoured scenario, is we go above your reserve price. Once the bidding increments have gone above your reserve price, the property will be announced on the market and then to be sold to the next highest bidder. Immediately upon the fall of the hammer, the contract will be deemed unconditional, a cash contract, not subject to finance, building of pest, and obviously with a five or a 10% deposit payable. This is a solid contract, one that won't fall over, and one that gives you confidence at the time of settlement, money will be in your account. The second scenario is that we have bidding, but we're not quite at your reserve price. In this scenario, we would simply pause the auction and seek your instructions. We would go back to the highest bidder and ask them to pay more money. We would then continue those discussions with you on a private basis, back and forth, whilst the auction is paused. Should we reach an agreement that both you and the buyer are satisfied with, we would then reopen the auction, announcing the property as on the market and to be sold. It's at this stage that the property has been announced as on the market that we may see further bidding from other buyers. In the third scenario, we may have no bidding or the bids made are a long way from your reserve price. In this scenario, there's no decision for you to make. We would simply pass the property in. From here, your agent, alongside the auctioneer, would make a recommendation regarding the list price to be advertised shortly thereafter. What we find is that when that list price, advertised price, is close, to market sentiment, feedback, and the offers that you've had pre-auction, a sale typically occurs shortly thereafter. It's at this stage that we'd ask that you take your agent's recommendations into strong consideration. Here at Ray White, we are auction specialists. We understand that in the coming days, you'll have many questions and queries. Please let either your agent or your auctioneer know. In the coming days, you'll be sitting with your auctioneer to discuss the reserve price and strategy for your auction. We at Ray White look forward to assisting you secure the best possible price for your property.